Hey, hello, what's up? This is Ever for the Mimal Be Blue Plow. You know the drill. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button and join the family by returning. Welcome back. Today I'm going to be doing the 50 bookish question tag. I chanced upon this when I was trying to get ideas for my next video. This is exciting. Let's get right into the video. Don't move. I'll be right back. What was the last book you read? The last book I read was The Labyrinth by Pearl North. Was it a good one? Yes, yes, yes. It was a good book. What made it good? Um the plot the character development the characters themselves the style of writing just everything about the book was good i actually enjoyed reading that book would you recommend it to other people of course i will i'm that generous so why not i recommend it how often do you read as often as i can do you like to read? Obviously. Obviously, I like to read. What was the last bad book you read? That would be In the Evil Day by Peter Temple. What made you dislike it? I did not even complete the book. That was how bad the book was. There was just something about it. I can't put my finger to it. I think it was the way the layout of a book i i just don't know it's just all over the place i i didn't like reading that book um do you wish to be a writer yeah i wish to be a writer any book ever influenced you greatly there's a book that has influenced me greatly that would be the flying ostrich you guys i keep mentioning this book that's how good that book was do you read fan fiction? Yes, I read fan fiction. Do you write fan fiction? No, I don't. I don't write fan fiction. What's your favorite book? Still, 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 undefeated. The Flying Ostrich by Diana McBagon Leary. What is your least favorite book? My least favorite book will probably be the book i didn't like reading i didn't even finish reading that book um in the evil day by peter Tem. you prefer physical books already on a device like a kindle i love physical books the feel the smell it feels like you can touch the words and just that whole thing makes me love physical books i prefer physical books to ready on a device like a candle when did you learn to read in kg or something i don't remember i don't know what was your favorite book you had to read in school blank cat by kobina sechi what is your favorite book series i haven't read a lot of book series but definitely be Harry Potter. Who is your favorite author? Do I have a favorite? I have a couple of favorite authors. Am I permitted to mention all of them? Maybe two um, or three. I like Josephine Cox. I like Diana McBagonguri. And I like Efo Kojoma, what is your favorite genre? Um, YA, YA novels. YA is my favorite genre. Like, I'm a young adult, so why not? Well, that's not what influenced my decision though. But I like YA novels, I like classics, I like contemporaries, and I like African literary pieces as well. Who is your favorite character in a book series? Harry Potter. Has a book ever transported you somewhere else? That is what books do. They always transport us into 
another world so of course yeah it has on several occasions which book do you wish had a sequel i don't know which book do you wish didn't have a sequel um still don't know how long does it take you to read a book it depends on my mood and how captivating the book is and how busy i think i am do you like when books become movies not always sometimes i just want the books to be just books because when it's adapted then it spoils everything so not all the time some books just need to remain books you do not adapt it no one needs that the book was ruined by its movie adaptation i haven't read that book but then um the movie adaptation i mean the beginning was good but to the end everything was just blah game of thrones game of thrones which movie has done a book justice matilda my goodness i watched that movie before i read the book and reading the book it didn't there wasn't any big difference i mean the movie wasn't so long but it did a justice to the book whoever directed that movie did amazing whoever did the script writing or whatever did amazing i mean the characters were equally good yeah obi matilda all day every day do you read newspapers i seldom read newspapers do you read magazines same as newspapers i seldom read magazines do you prefer magazines or newspapers or be magazines do you read while in bed yes i do read while in bed do you read while on the toilet I've read while sitting on the toilet before it's nothing new now do you read while in the car my all-time favorite place to read of course i do read majority of the pages when i'm in the car do you read well in the bath i don't read well in the bath are you a fast reader it depends on the book i'm reading if the book is complex where i need to take my time of course i'm not a fast reader then but it, if it's not complex everything is just flowing then i'm a fast reader are you a slow reader it depends on the book i'm reading of course where is your favorite place to read in the church or i have said this and i'll continue saying that in the church or when i'm in a car basically that. is it hard for you to concentrate while you read no not at all do you need a room to be silent while you read sometimes what book is next on your list to read um one of my books on my tbr list yeah that will be next in line if you haven't watched that video you should go and watch i'll leave a card somewhere for you to to watch when did you start to read chapter books probably when i read matilda i think that is my first chapter book i, I read who is your favorite children's book author that would be Raoul Dow and Samantha Caprio Negret. Which author would you most want to interview? Diana Mac Bagon Louis, of course. The ever amazing. If you're watching, I got my eyes on you. Eyes, eyes on you. Which author do you think you'd be friends with? Amanda Hawking because she bears my first name what book have you reread the most in the chest of a woman by efo kojo maube which books do you consider classics harry potter books do you think should be taught in every school um i think all books should be taught in school well except the inappropriate ones which books should be banned from all schools of course books that are inappropriate should be banned from all, all schools this brings us to the end of this video if you liked it please give a thumbs up subscribe 
hit the notification bell so you get notified when i post a video till then catch you on my next video bye guys <laughs>